We're going live in three, two, one. For those just joining us, we are fortunate to have an audience today with our glorious leader. Excellency, last week we experienced the conclusion of the trial of the tyrant King Solomon with his execution scheduled for next Friday. With the Great Revolution finally concluded, what will the future political structure of the People's Republic of Bisenji finally look like? Well, Zara, King Salman was a corrupt and sadistic man. Under his rule, our people served while he sold away our most sacred objects to pay for his own luxuries. Hundreds of thousands of souls died under his tyranny, yet he was tolerated by the American imperialists. His death will give us closure, but our work is only just beginning. The people's revolution is never really over. We must rebuild this country from the ashes, reform it. The Revolutionary Council has put me in charge of the transitional government for the next five years to maintain order while a new constitution is drafted one that meets the needs of all the people. Many were expecting your brother Farouk would be named by the Revolutionary Council as the interim leader of Besenji. What role will he have in the transitional government? Farouk is popular to be certain and was a fellow patriot of the revolution. He will be given an appropriate role in my cabinet. It is often said that the Americans are suspicious of our transitional government and that you face a great deal of pressure from domestic interests seeking reforms. Our first priority is, of course, reconstruction. The American imperialists are of no concern at this time. Governance is not an easy task, but I assure the people that we will build a stronger Basenji together. Thank you again for your time, Excellency. It is a pleasure, Zara. Excellency, my name is Tariq Badur. As Parliamentary Chief of Protocol, it is my duty to ensure that your instructions reach our parliamentarians. I trust you have settled into your new office? May I offer some suggestions on our first steps to restoring order to Bajinji? Yes, please begin. Excellent. To start, there are two units of currency to be concerned with. One is our treasury funds and the other is the loyalty of our parliament. We will need to rebuild basic infrastructure to begin. Click on the State Infrastructure button. And now click on the Policies button.
click on the treasury button. Oh, do you have any orders, Excellency? How is morale within our armed forces? The armed forces are satisfied with your leadership. They know you are doing your best. I'm considering deploying our forces into Boethia, but other risks. We have insufficient intelligence on the exact number and deployment on the Boethian military. Without better information, any attack against them will carry a significant risk. Thanks. That's all for now. Your Excellency, I am Prime Minister Amal Sarkos, and on behalf of Boethia, I wanted to be the first to welcome the liberation of the People's Republic of Bajinci from the tyranny of the Salman family. The Salman regime was, the regime was a threat to the whole region. That is why we provided your provided your rebellion, your rebellion, your rebellion with rebellion with weaponry and training necessary to overthrow the tyrant. Once the transitional government has restored Bashinsi's infrastructure and industry, let us work towards restoring our trade relationship. Do not hesitate to contact me if there is any way Boethia can be of assistance to you. Thank you, thank you for your call. I, I am certain, certain are too great, too great, too great, too great, bring great prosperity to the region. There is much work to be done, but I am grateful for your country's support. Apologies, but I must go. Let us speak again later. Goodbye. 